So my name is Pete Latta and I'm the chairman and CEO of A. Dewey Pile Incorporated, a family owned business that's uh, going to be turning 100 years old here in uh, 2024. People outside of our industry look at it and they say it's about trucks, it's about technology, it's about facility. And we always think that they're tools of the trade, but at the end of the day we're a service business and people create service and their, their desire to be not as good as the competition, just as good or better is, is a defining you know, factor of success. So uh, at, at Pile, we you know, embrace that this is a people business. We're an LTL based company, we do have other branches as well, but um, you know, our main focus is LTL. LTL is less than truckload. Uh, so anything, we're basically, you know, your basic parcel, small parcel like UPS, on a larger scale. We're doing it with freight, pallets, you know, large items rather than just, you know, small boxes and things like that. We expanded into Virginia and this terminal here will cover all the way to Bristol and Southwest Virginia from Lexington and down into the Danville area. The two main arteries in the Northeast are the 81 corridor and the 95 corridor. And, and you know, that's, that. I don't say it's the center of our universe, but we feel we need to serve both of those corridors, the population, the biz, both business, consumer, better than anybody else. And uh, so Roanoke was a natural on the 81 corridor for us. I've been with A. Dewey Pyle for almost 19 years. Um, I started out working the docks, driving a tow motor, I've driven a truck, I've ran a dock, I've done operations, I've done sales, and you know, I, I was very excited to take a promotion here as a service center manager in Rome. Personally, I'm thrilled, you know, coming from Ohio, you know, we have very long winters and it's, I'm an outdoor person, so, you know, we've got the mountains here, we've got, you know, we're, we've got the lakes, the mountains, lots of hiking. One, During COVID, it was really highlighted. We were restocking the shelves of America. And uh, there was a lot of disruption in the supply chain during COVID, uh, you know, as uh, areas of the world shut down. And I think a lot of businesses realized that all the offshoring they had done to drive cost out of their products, all of a sudden, that was really fragile. We move everything that you see in the stores. We move everything that, before it gets to the stores, you know, it needs to move from manufacturer to distribution. It needs to get to the manufacturer so it can be made, uh, you know. I don't think that today people realize how large trucking is to everyday living. With Core Values Foundation, good culture, trust, we believe we earn discretionary effort. And in a service business, if our composite discretionary effort is better than brand X, we're going to outperform and win in a service business, both in terms of efficient operations and quality of service operation. I enjoy the, the challenge that comes with every day. But more than anything, I enjoy working for A. Dewey Pyle. Um, you know, our owner is in there right now, and he can come here, and he's, we're, we're pushing 4,000 employees. He can come here, and he knows not only my name, I've obviously been here for a while, but he knows everyone's name, you know, by name. He knows people by name. And when you get into a company our size, that's rare these days. Um, and the family that runs this company is, is truly a different breed, in a good way. We hope we can be supported by the business community and commercial community in Roanoke so that we outgrow this facility and as a privately owned business, we like to own our own real estate and we'll find a land site and build.